Hi Virgo, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Virgo, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Virgo. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Ace of Swords, and this is Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius Energy. So this is an energy of communication coming in. This is an energy of breakthrough, victory, and um, seeing through something, getting some sort of clarity on something. So let's see. We have the Judgment card, Scorpio Energy, the Ten of Cups, Water Energy, and the Nine of Swords in the reverse air energy. So there's an energy of someone speaking their truth to you. And whatever this truth is, this communication, it has the potential to lead to a relationship, an emotionally fulfilling relationship. Someone could be, someone could be giving you um, reassurance. Uh, with the Judgment card, they're giving you answers, and it's transforming their connection with you in a positive way. So let's let's clarify these cards okay so we have the three of cups and this is water energy Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. So this is a card of reunions. This could be someone you know, and you're having, you're giving this love a second chance, and it's possible that you guys are choosing to commit this time around in a very deep and meaningful way. Um, there is a feeling of going out, celebrating, having, you know, it's like you're getting good news from this person because the Three of Cups is a very celebratory energy. So let's see, we have the. The star, Aquarius energy, the tower in the reverse, Mars energy, and we have the four of cups in the reverse, Mars energy. So this could be um, water energy. So this could be someone who it's like moving out of the friend zone um, or reconnecting and becoming lovers, like genuine romantic partners, being in a relationship. Um, you know, this person is seizing the opportunity. This is someone who in the past, there was a missed opportunity, and this time around, they, they, they're going to go for it. Um, they want to save their connection to you. They want to fight for this. They want to restore the connection, and there's this feeling of success. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, um, Virgo. Okay, we have surrendered to the divine full moon. Okay, we have romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. Okay, so definitely giving something another chance, a genuine chance. Okay, we have strength of character and moral integrity. Character cannot be developed in ease and quiet. Only through experiences of trial and suffering can the soul be strengthened, vision cleared, ambition inspired, and success achieved. So definitely coming back together more mature, more wise, having learned um, from life. You know, it's like this person, you, you guys may have separated and you're, you're giving things a second chance. Okay, so I'm gonna pull out a card for your advice, Virgo.
Okay, we have surrender comparisons with other people. Keep your eyes trained on yourself. Focus on your own strengths, attractiveness, and power. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Virgo. I hope you have a really, really good day, Virgo. Bye, Virgo.